Hi, I'm Nina. In this short video look to install an LED light into your business premises. I'll give an introduction of what LED lighting is, and then we'll look at how this upgrade can save your business money as well as cutting your carbon emissions. LED stands for light emitting diode. This is a type of semiconductor which converts electrical energy directly into light. Traditional lighting such as halogens and fluorescents give off light but also a lot of heat which is wasted energy. So what are the benefits of switching to LED lighting? The main benefit is they consume less energy meaning lower running costs and lower carbon emissions than more traditional lighting. LED lights can last a very long time, up to five times longer than traditional lighting. This brings additional cost savings as the light doesn't have to be replaced with new fittings and the maintenance costs are lowered. This is especially beneficial for businesses with lighting in hard to reach places that require specialist equipment in order to change the lights. LEDs give higher quality light. They have a high colour rendering index, meaning colours appear natural and there is a large range of colours and styles of LED lighting. So this means you can get the best lighting to suit your business. There are some cases where LEDs may not be the best option. This includes high temperature environments as overheating can shorten their lifespan. Another potential downside to LED lighting is flicker. Some poor quality LEDs can emit a flicker which may cause headaches in staff. More importantly, if your business has moving machinery parts, for example rotating belts, a stroboscopic effect may be induced. This can make moving parts appear stationary, or as if they are moving slowly, this can potentially lead to serious injury. So how exactly do LEDs save energy? Firstly, LEDs have a high luminous efficacy. This means that they give off a lot of light using only a small amount of power. So a 50 watt halogen lamp and a 5 watt LED lamp will emit the same number of lumens. However, the LED uses only 5 watt of power and the halogen lamp uses 50 watt. This is a saving of 90% of the energy and also the running costs. LEDs work well with lighting controls and are dimmable. Both of these measures can reduce the amount of energy that an LED requires. The first choice you will need to make when upgrading to LED lighting will be between retrofitting the LED lamps into the existing light fittings or replacing the entire fitting known as the luminaire. There are benefits to both options. There are a large variety of LED light products to pick from that can be retrofitted into your existing light fittings. They are inexpensive and easy to install. It's worth noting that some existing light fittings may limit the brightness of an LED and will not have the hardware built in to dim them. When selecting your lighting, you'll need to consider wattage. This is how much energy per second a light will use to light up. LEDs require a lower wattage than other traditional lamps, so they'll often come with two wattages on the box. This is the wattage of the LED and the wattage of the traditional light that it will replace. Often, a better way to replace lighting is to consider the lumen output of your original lighting and replace the original lamp with an LED of the same number of lumens. Different areas of a business will require different types and brightness of light. You can use a table on screen to determine what level of lighting is correct for your business, depending on the activities which you carry out. LED lights work very well with various forms of lighting control. These can automatically control the lights, cutting back on wastage and unnecessary carbon emissions. There are a few types. Movement sensors or occupancy controls come in two main types, presence detection and absence detection. Presence detection senses movement in the room, turning the lights on and off accordingly. Absence detection requires turning on manually, but will sense when the space is empty and turn the lights off. Time controlled lighting turns on lights at specified times. These work particularly well for outside lighting. Light sensors monitor the brightness in an area from natural daylight and dim or turn off the lights when appropriate levels of illuminance are achieved. Different controls are available for different situations, as shown in the table on screen. Here you can find the best fit lighting for your business. The versatility of LED lighting allows employees to adjust the light to whatever best suits them. So, that's a brief introduction to LED lighting. The cost of upgrading to LED lighting will vary depending on the type of lighting selected and the operational hours of your business. However, many upgrades have a payback period of just a couple of years. This makes it an attractive option to improve the energy efficiency and climate impact of your business. I hope you found this video useful. 
You can find out more information on LED lighting by downloading our fact sheet.